Hi everybody. What's up? This is a little flashlight that I made. It's basically a USB cord here that I drilled into a Eclipse Mints sort of like gum can. It's got a switch and it, it is very bright. Uh, this has got eight LEDs. And what's really special about this, what's really cool about it, you can pop the top open here and you can see, if I can just turn on the light in here, that it's got a little, what do you call it, little plug in there that basically allows me to charge it off 12 volts because I put in a 240 ohm resistor which lowers the voltage down from 12 volts to about 4.4, 4.5 volts which is about the nominal voltage for a 3.6 volt rechargeable battery which is what I have in there, it is 600 milliamps considering this is about 8 LEDs, LEDs take about 50 milliamps, uh, 8 fives are uh, 4, uh, sorry, 8 fives are 40, so this takes about 400 milliamps, this will last longer than an hour it is cool and just to show how bright it is, I'll turn this off, move it away. There's a dark spot in there, and it just lights up. You can see everything. It's not so good in the camera, but I can see everything. So uh, I've got another thing to show you if you just come over here. Hi, everybody. What's up? Okay, this is my second model. Yeah, here's the old one here. This is my second one. Basically, it's the same thing, pretty much, but it's a little more compact. Uh, I'm charging it right now. It's the same thing, but a smaller battery. It is a 3.6 volt battery, but only 40 milliamps. Only 40 milliamps. Like I said in the previous video, uh, LEDs take about 50 milliamps, so this will last almost an hour, or even an hour in that matter. If I can try and get this off I can show you it properly uh, I found the board at the side of the road same thing and um, basically uh, the I put the switch on and it's only one LED don't forget and then the the same plug it's the same thing 12 volts down to about 4.5 volts and if I turn off it actually is quite bright not as bright as the other one but it is very very bright. Well, where's the switch? Here it is. Alright. As you can see, it, it is still very bright for one LED. I am actually very, very surprised with it. Uh, what else? There's nothing much else. Thank you for listening, I guess. What's up? There is one thing I forgot. There I have an Xside 115 amp hour battery right there. It is connected to three solar panels, all adding up to 25 watts. Okay, there, there is the charge controller, which runs up through a wire to those two 12 volt fluorescent lights, which I use all the time, basically. Now, the thing that's special about this is that it can be charged of 12 volts. The thing that's special about my solar setup is that it has it comes down a cigarette lighter, and th this is basically the same plug, and I can just use this to charge up these. Okay, uh, I won't do it now. It's too hard now. Um, <laughs> don't forget that this is a 600 milliamp hour battery that's inside here at the bottom. I don't know if you can see, but if you look down, there's a green sort of cartridge. That is the battery. 3 cell, 3.6 volt, 600 milliamp. The 240 ohm resistor only allows about 50 amps, uh, 50 milliamps, sorry, to be pumped through it. Now if this is a 600 amp hour, uh, 600 milliamp hour battery, sorry I'm a little tired, then it's going to take quite a while to charge. This one, on the other hand, will take only about an hour to charge, and it is brilliant. And basically, that's all.
Do you guys want to see anything more? Just post a request. I've got a lot of other stuff. I'll let you guys look around the room. Look at what I've got. See ya, Pan. That's my sister. Oi. Alright, you know, anything I've got, anything you want, just request it. Forever.